My wife put together something this morning on the inter on, on her Facebook page that I thought eloquently grabbed exactly what we were thinking. We have uh, we've had a long night with our children and grandbabies that we have left. If she's going to share this with you. Frank and I want to say thank you to all the outpouring of love for our family, from family, friends, and complete strangers. News media have been bombarding us with requests to share and comment and appear to celebrate Annabelle's life. However, as much tragedy as that entails for our family, we don't want to overshadow the other lives lost yesterday. We lost more than Belle yesterday. And one thing that gives me a sliver of encouragement is the fact that Belle was surrounded yesterday by her church family that she loved fiercely and vice versa. Our church was not comprised of members or parishioners. We were a very close family. We ate together, we laughed together, we cried together, and we worshiped together. Now most of our church family is gone. Our building is probably beyond repair. And the few of us that are left behind lost tragically yesterday. As senseless as this tragedy was, our sweet Belle would not have been able to deal with losing so much family yesterday. Please don't forget Sutherland Springs. I don't understand, but I know my God does. And that's where I'll leave that. There's a video. Thank you for coming.